Um, I've seen a lot of fantastic looks walk up and down this carpet yes. tonight, but as soon as you turned up, I was like, she looks mighty. Oh, Is this gosh, what we're going mighty. for today? I use that. I look mighty. You look mighty. Thank you. Um, what is going to be your lasting memory from season three of Bridgeton? Either part one or part, or part two, we can take away. I think my lasting memory will be um, the Queen and Whistledown. I think that's, that's you know, a wonderful kind of uh, celebration to start the new chapter, which I hope there will be more. You know, we'll see what happens with them. But I, I personally have been waiting to kind of get that connection and that scene and that kind of identity revealed. The Queen has as well. I know Nicola, you know, Nicola and I have talked about having that, some kind of scene together. So yeah, I'm glad that that's happened. And um, just look around us right now. We can yes. really see the Bridgerton fandom in real life, know, can't we? It does not a day amazing. go by now where Bridgerton does not touch you in Affects some way. No, yeah. no, not a day goes by, not a single day. Yes, I love it. They're great. They're very gracious, uh, very um, respectful, but how, a lot of enthusiasm is there. How has Bridgerton changed your life? Uh, pre Bridgerton and post Bridgerton, how has your life changed? Um, it's changed, you know, work wise. I'm getting offered some really lovely stuff to do, which is great. And I think as an actress, you always want that to happen. That, you know, a role, a show will break break you out into other areas. So yeah, I'm really gr I'm grateful to have Bridgerton as my kind of staple, and then do a couple of desserts here and there. Phenomenal! Congratulations on your success. Thank, Thank you so much so for your much. time. Cheers. Cheers.